rotate our neck around. Two rotations each way. Go nice and slow, no rush. And then go ahead and rotate the other way. Good job. Give yourself a hug, wide feet. Now, for here, try not to bring your hips back and try not to rotate your hips. Okay? We're gonna first flex forward, round forward. Rotate to your left. Bend into the side, extend back. Rotate toward the other side, bend into that side, flex down. Rotate, bend, extend. Rotate, bend, flex down. Let's go ahead and rotate the other way, so flex down. Rotate to your right, bend into the side, extend back. Rotate, bend, flex down. Keep rotating, bend, extend. Rotate, bend, flex down. Shake it out a little bit. Okay, scapula, bring your hands next to your sides. We're gonna shrug our shoulders up, back, down, forward. Up, back, down, forward. Up, back, down, and forward. Other way, back, up, keep the elbows straight, fingers glued, down and forward, back, up, forward, down, back, up, forward, and down. Okay, shoulder, wrap one hand around. to reach all the way up. Reach all the way back, and down. Back, around, all the way up, across, and down. One more, all the way up around, back, like you're reaching in the back seat of a car. Press the thigh, reach back, unwind, up, forward, and down. Go ahead and switch. Reach back, rotate internally at the end. External rotation there, reach back and up, cross the body, and down. One more time, all the way up, back and around, back and up, forward and down. All right, shake it out a little bit. So that was the upper body. So pirate ship, when I say the captain's coming, you're gonna bring your feet together, bring your hands up to your forehead, and you're gonna say, aye aye captain. All right, so when I say captain's coming, you're gonna say aye aye captain. Ready, here we go. The captain's coming. Aye aye, captain. Good job. Now when I say hit the plank, you're gonna drop down and get in the push-up position, four hands and knees. If you don't wanna do that, you can just reach out front and squat, okay? Or you can go to the plank position. Ready? All right, the captain's coming. Aye aye, captain. Get down on the plank. Hold, 10, 9, 8, 7. If you want to bring the knees down, that's fine. 5, 4, 3, 2. Let's walk those feet back up. The captain's coming. Aye, aye, captain. Captain wants us to go up to the second floor. So let's go ahead and climb up to the second floor of the ship. Climb it up. He wants to see if there's any pirates out there, so go ahead and get in a lunge position. And pretend that you're looking at your scope. We're looking this way here. Okay, I don't see anything. You can rotate here. Let's look the other way. So use the other leg to lunge. You can rotate here. Okay, I don't see anything. Let's go to the third floor, all the way up. 
Keep going all the way up. Look back out. Okay, nothing over here. Other side. Uh, I think I see some pirates. So, let's climb back down. Let's hurry up and get down. Climb down the second floor to the first floor. Let's run to the captain. All right, captain, we see some pirates. Captain's orders, he wants us to pretend that we're getting ready for the pirate fight with the sword. So you're gonna pretend you're doing a sword fight. Okay, so we're gonna go forward and then back. Okay, forward and then back. You go up, you go across and forward and then back. Just use the other arm, okay? Use the other arm forward and then back, forward and back, forward and back. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and sail. So we're gonna sail around, so pretend that you're sailing around in a small circle. Sailing around, one more. Now let's rotate the other way. Two rotations, all the way, keep sailing. Keep sailing. All right, so we've made it, but we have to walk the plank. So the captain is not mad, is pretty mad at us, so we need to bring our hands behind our back. We're gonna take one, two, and then option one is just to jump like that. Or option three, or option two, you can jump all the way into the water, okay? So we're gonna walk the plank, hands behind, one, two, and jump into the water. And from here, let's go back. We're gonna do one more. One, two, jump in the water. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and start swimming now. So it's gonna get on our stomach, or you can stand or kneel. Okay, it's up to you, you can stand, kneel, or go on the stomach. If you're able to go on the stomach, we're going to opposite arm, opposite leg. So Pilates swimmer here. So we're gonna swim to the island. Key swim, we're gonna go for 30 seconds here. Swim, try to point the toe here. Maybe flutter the feet. Let's see if you can go fast here. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and let's swim. Let's get into our boat. We're going to get into our boat. We're going to row the boat forward and back. All the way forward, all the way back. If you want to go all the way down, you can. Up to you. Forward and back. If you're standing, it can look just like this. Or option one, you're just pushing and pulling. Okay? Pull it. Nice and slow down. Pull it. And let's go ahead and pretend that we're in a canoe. Okay, you might have to go one side a little bit more than the other. And then the other side. Or you can go both sides. Okay, we just got on the island. Let's go ahead and stand up. We have to go find our treasure. So let's go ahead and march. Oh, uh, I think there's a lion. Get down. Okay, that's just a bush. Go ahead and march. Uh-oh, I see an elephant. All right, so go ahead and pretend that you're an elephant. Swing that nose, that long nose, and then switch side. All right, let's go ahead and dig for treasure. Dig, digging for treasure. Let's dig this way first. Now, if you feel like this is moderate or vigorous, you can take your mask off since you're 12 feet apart. I'm not allowed to, but if you want to, you can. And other side, dig.
Keep going. All right, let's use our hands to dig. Keep digging, keep digging. And let's pick up your treasure. And what we found was actually a medicine ball treasure. So go ahead and get your medicine ball out or your backpack. Set it down in front of you. And then grab some water. We're about to go through our medicine ball fitness. Okay, we got about a minute break. So get some water, focus on your breathing, and get ready for medicine ball fitness. If you don't have a med ball, you can use a backpack or a book. If you don't have a bed, um, backpack or a book, you can use, just pretend that you have that med ball for today, okay? So just pretend that you're holding that med ball. All right, so we're gonna do the same workout as yesterday to keep it a little bit routine so we're not switching up too many of the exercises. And we'll actually do the same exercises tomorrow to keep that medicine ball workout a routine so hopefully you remember those exercises, okay? All right, so we're gonna go ahead and pick up the med ball. I'm gonna hold on to it or pretend you have a med ball or a book. Now the first exercise is the goblet squat, just like this, okay? Now, if you can't squat or if you're not standing, what you can do is you can just make circles, just like this with the med ball, both ways or one way, it's up to you, okay? So we're gonna start with the squat, here we go. We're gonna go for 10 reps. Ready, and here we go. Down, up, one, down, up, two, down, up, three, down, up, four, down, up, five, down, up, six, down, up, seven, down, up, eight, down, up, nine, down, up, and ten. Woo! Fifteen second break, get some water if you need it. Inhale and exhale. Get some water if you need it. Another inhale, another exhale. All right. Iso rotational hold. We're gonna go wide feet. We're gonna reach across our body without turning our hips. We're gonna try to straighten our arms for 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, Seven, six, five, four, three, and two, and down. Quick relax. And other side hold. Try to straighten your elbows. Reach. Keep going. 15 more seconds. Hold. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, and take another 15 second break. Inhale and exhale. The next one is gonna be the press, okay? If you don't have a ball, you can just do some air punches for this one, okay? So up to you. If you're seated and you don't have upper body, you can do some kicking. All right, so here we go. Pick up the ball. We can press forward, diagonal, or overhead, depending on your skill level. Here we go, we're gonna go for 12 reps. Down and up, one, down, up, two, down, up, three, down, up, four, down, up, five, down, up, six, down, up, seven, down, up, eight, down, up, Nine, down, up, 10, down, two more, up, 11, down, up, 12, and down, and 15 second break. The next two exercises are on the ground here. So go ahead and make your way to the seated position with your ball. I'll demonstrate the exercise before we do it. So this is that leg lift. Straight arm, isometric hold, leg lift, working the core, 
and hip flexors, which is also part of the core, all right? We're gonna go for 10 total reps. Here we go. Now, if you are seated or standing, what you can do is hold the ball and you can kick with your legs while you're seated or you can bring your knees up. All right, here we go. We're gonna hold the ball, straighten one leg. If you wanna make it easier, you can bend the knee. We're gonna hold, switch, down, one. Up, switch, hold, two. Up, switch, hold, three. Up, switch, down, four. Up, switch, down, five. Up, switch, down, six. Up, switch, down, seven. Up, switch, down, eight. Up, switch, down, nine. Up, switch, down, and 10. All right, the next one is on our hands and knees. If you're seated for this next one, you're just going to reach across the body back and forth, or you can challenge yourself by holding the ball with one hand. And if you want a real challenge, you can go like that. So that would be if you're not gonna go to your hands and knees for this one. So if you are on your hands and knees, we're going to bring our hands outside of the ball or the object. Or just think of something that's in there in front of you. You're gonna reach forward, touch the ground, reach forward, touch the ground. If you wanna make it harder, you can bring the knees off the ground and try to reach and touch. Now, if you need to bring the knees down, that's fine. We're gonna go for 20 seconds. All right, here we go. Ready? And go. 20 seconds, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Good job. All right. Let's take a minute break, get some water. Let's go ahead and roll that ball away. All right, let's go ahead and sit up nice and tall. Let's go ahead and bring both arms up like a goal post here. And try to bring those thumbs back. And then from here, we're gonna try to bring those thumbs forward. Okay, let's go ahead and switch, thumbs back. Thumbs forward. And we're gonna tee it out, palms face down. And then from here, let me see the back of your hands. Hold, if this is uncomfortable on your legs, you can straighten your legs or you can sit any way you want. From here, other way, palms face up, now back. See so if you can get that pinky up. Yep, externally rotate those shoulders. And then internally rotate, thumbs go down. Keep cranking it here, hold. Five, four, three, two, and relax. Okay, from here we're gonna reach forward. We're gonna bring our fingertips together so I can see your palms. We're gonna really round that upper back out and straighten the arms. We're gonna try to inhale into the belly, and then exhale, belly collapses. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. One more, inhale, and exhale. Good. From here, let's go to our backs into the bridge pose. So if you can, 
You're gonna go onto your back. If you're sitting in a chair or you're standing up, you can just bring one knee into your chest. If you're on your back, you can just bring one knee into your chest here, just like this, and hold. Then bring your hand underneath, and then you just straighten the knee, and then bend the knee. Straighten, bend. Straighten and hold, point the toe. Are you gonna try to trace a circle on the ceiling here? Try little circles here. With, try, try to do it without your hands behind your thigh. And then go ahead and rotate the other way. Go ahead and switch. Hold the knee. Breathe. Inhale. Exhale. If you're standing or sitting, just bring your knee to your chest. Inhale. Exhale. And then from here, go ahead and extend the knee. Flex the toe or toe toward the shin. And then bend the knee. Extend. Bend. Extend. And bend. Go ahead and extend, point the toe. Do little circles here all the way around and then go ahead and circle the other way good job from here you can have knees bent and just bring your arms overhead try to inhale belly exhale push all the air out inhale belly obliques and lower back Exhale it out. Inhale, 360. Fill a balloon up in your stomach. Exhale it out. From here, cross one leg over. If you're not on the ground with us, I just want you to focus on your breathing. Inhale and exhale as you rotate that ankle in a circle here, nice and slow. Go ahead and rotate the other way. Switch side. If you're standing or seated, just focus on your inhales and exhales, or try to roll, you can try to rotate your wrists or your ankles. Go ahead and switch side, rotate the ankle. If you're unable to rotate the ankle, or if you want to add in wrist circles too, you can. Go ahead and rotate the other way. All right, go ahead and sit all the way up. Go to our butterfly stretch. All right, bring your hands together. If you're um, standing, some, I'm making sure that I'm always trying to include the upper body. So if someone's not seated like this, they could do this. So that's why I'm always trying to do something upper body and lower. Now I can challenge you here, if I push those hands together, push those hands together. Good, and if you're seated with us, see if you can bring one foot off the ground and hold for five, four, three, two, and then if you can, see if you can straighten it out. High hold, three, two, and slowly bring it down. And we're gonna stretch into that leg here. Hold and breathe. Try to bring, try to have a straight back. Try not to just collapse. Try to reach forward here. Breathe, inhale, exhale. If you're seated or standing, you can still reach for one leg. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Now we're gonna see if we can bring that foot back without touching it, so we're gonna bring that up in the air and then slowly bring it back to butterfly. All right, now we're gonna try the other thing. It's the same thing on the other side. So bring your hands together, squeeze, lift that foot up and hold, three, two, and then see if you can straighten it out nice and high. Three, two, 
and slowly bring it down. And then from here, stretch. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. And let's cross our legs. If you're in a chair, just reach forward. Or if you're standing, reach for your toes. And if you're cross leg, just reach forward. We're gonna inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, belly. Exhale, get all the air out. Sit up nice and tall. All right, that's gonna do it for today, everybody, a special Olympic.